Hello friends, welcome back. I hope you liked the first session where we installed the Android Studio and I have also told you about the basic building blocks of Android. Some of you, in fact, about 50% of you could get an error when you are trying to install Android Studio, that is Intel HAXM installation failed error. First we will see how the error comes and then I will tell you what is it and what is the solution available for it. You can see the error here, I have recorded that for you. Intel HAXM installation failed error will come and this is a common error, don't worry, this can be sorted out so easily. But before we go into it, let's understand what is this. HAXM stands for Hardware Accelerated Execution Manager. It is a cross-platform hardware assisted virtualization engine which is nothing but a hypervisor. The Android emulator which we are going to use will certainly use the HAXM in the Intel platforms to speed up and to improve the performance. And the installation of the HAXM could fail for multiple reasons but the most common reasons are in the BIOS your virtualization could be disabled or you may have an antivirus like Avast which could prevent this from getting installed. So we will see how exactly one can check if virtualization in the BIOS is enabled or disabled. You can see that here I am going to task manager this is Windows 11. So in the task manager go to performance there you can see that virtualization is disabled. This is the reason I got that error. That's it. Now how do we fix it? Very simple. I need to go to BIOS. See that you need to press the key which is prescribed for your laptop. Mine is a HP laptop so I pressed F10 while booting. And in that I am going into the BIOS and I need to set up one small thing. After that this problem will be sorted out. Now you can see that I am into the BIOS. Main security system configuration exit is all there. We need to navigate and we need to select the appropriate one where we can enable the virtualization. Now you can see that in security is not there. In system configuration, virtualization technology is there. It is disabled. That's the reason we got the HAXM installation failed. You could see that now I am trying to enable it. I have enabled it. I need to save and come out, restart. That's all. Your problem is sorted out. You need to enable the virtualization technology in the BIOS and the key is F10 for my laptop. It could be a different key for you for you to enter into BIOS while you are booting. So once you have done that, you can save the changes and come out and you can restart your PC. That's what I have done right now. So that's all. It's all done. Now I can check if my virtualization is enabled. After restart, I am going to the same task manager and there virtualization is enabled under the performance. That's all. Now what will happen? We can check if the installation is getting completed. I am going to show you that right now. I am continuing the process. The installation of HAXM will go on fine and it will be done in few seconds for you. It's installed successfully. That's all. You are free to go ahead and start your coding right now in Android. It's going to be very very interesting and we are going to learn that. In the next session, you will see the first code. We are going to check if your system is working fine. We are going to see if your phone can get the Android app run, the first code, the hello world code run and that's going to be very, very interesting. Thank you very much for following my channel, the content. We will have more learning shortly. Thank you.